to bloom, you have to look sick. Ah! Hey, 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 ha! What in the hayseed is going on in there, silly Billy? Oh, Granny Smith, we were just about to come get you. Apple Bloom's sick. Looks like she might have to stay home all week. <laughs> Perfect as a Piccadilly pear. Now what? It's already almost sundown. Tomorrow is Sunday and I only have one more day to figure something out. Hey, look! That's the fourth sign! <laughs> Appreciation Day, so let's move Harvest Day instead. They don't look quite ripe. Harvesting apples early never hurt an apple. I don't know. Zap apple trees aren't like normal apple trees. They're magic. How different can they be? Well, if we can't buck them, let's just pick them. <laughs> Any other bright ideas? Granny Smith, it's Miss Cheerly. Apple Bloom said you wanted to speak with me. Hello, Granny Smith. Oh. Well, hello there. How do you do? Uh, hi, uh, Granny Smith. Is uh, everything okay? Of course it is. Why would you be? <laughs> oh, uh, excuse me. Uh, pickles always give me the hiccups. I need to tell you that I can't make the presentation on Monday after all. Oh, no. Is that so? No doubts about it. I gotta share the flowers and water the sheep. I mean, uh, I have to water the flowers and share the sheep. <laughs> oh, oh, that's too bad. We can reschedule. <laughs> well, howdy, Miss Cheerily. You window shopping? Uh, no. Uh, you asked me to come here to tell me that you wouldn't be making it to Family Appreciation Day? Fiddlesticks! I wouldn't miss it for all the tea in Canterlot. But <laughs> didn't you just say, See you Monday? Hmm. I can't believe she woke up from her nap. She never wakes up from her nap. I wish I could just run off and hide. Well, you can't run off, but maybe some pony else can. Pony, it was really no big deal. To me, it was. You're my hero, Rainbow Dad. That Rainbow Dash sure is something. Something special.
cheering for every pony's favorite hero, Rainbow Dash! <laughs> I can think of a few new words, and I bet modest is not one of them. <laughs> no, but she is kind of awesome. thing might be going to Rainbow Dash's head. You may be right, silly. And then I zoomed into the well. I knew it would be dark and dangerous, but I didn't let that stop me. Danger's my middle name, Rainbow Danger Dash. Thinking back on it, I acted pretty awesomely heroic that day. That day. Awesomely heroic that day and awesomely arrogant ever since. Mm-hmm. Hey, Applejack. How would you like to be immortalized as my friend? Immortal what? Are you taking notes? Yep, I've been hoof-picked by Rainbow Dash herself to write her autobiography. Um, autobiographies are supposed to be written by the pony they are about. Maybe for your normal run-of-the-mill ponies. But I'm far too busy saving lives to stop and write. That's why I hired Spike as my ghostwriter. Ah! Spike the ghost! I thought it would make you happy. Happy! Happy! I... I just need some time alone. Huh. How's the sleepover rarities going? Why, it's smashing! Huh? I just wish we could do something special together that didn't include me goofing anything up. Oh, the Sisterhood Social! Applejack and I do it every year. You and Rarity can compete against other sister teams in all these neat events. <gasps> that sounds like the perfect way for us to hang out. Rarity will think it's an excellent idea. What a ridiculous idea. A contest at Sweet Apple Acres. It doesn't sound very clean. So what? Now you're back to hating messes? Sweetie Belle, watch your tone. I am still your big sister. Right. And any sister who cares about her sister goes. Sweetie Belle, honestly, playing silly little games in the dirt is just uncouth, with or without a sister. Well, then, maybe, maybe I'll try the sister of social without a sister. In fact, I think I'll try the rest of my life without a sister. Oh, 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 I'm the one who's ruining your life. Really? Have you looked around this place? I'm the one who would be better off with no sister. Well, it looks like we finally agree on something. Neither of us needs a sister. Deal! Deal! Goodbye, unsister! The Sisterhood Social was on coop? Yeah, on coop. <coughs> Wait, what's on coop? It's not just the social. She thinks I'm on coop. Honey, Rarity thinks everything's on coop. What's on coop? It means uncivil, you know, bad mannered. 
Bah. Exactly. Sweetie Belle, just give Rarity some time. She'll come around. Sisters always do. Not sisters like Rarity. Come on now. Apple Bloom and I got some chores to finish up on. Maybe you can help. You sure you want me to help? I just mess everything up. Oh, come on. That's just stinking thinking. Watch. to do chores together. Oh, all that work ruined. Thanks to Sweetie Belle. Oh my, it's usually a big mess in here. <gasps> Idea! This is genius! I shall call it Full Spectrum Fashions. I have Sweetie Belle hadn't... <clears throat> no matter. She still shouldn't have touched my things without permission. Hmm. We gotta try something else. I've got it, brother of mine. Well done, Flam. We're at top of the trivia. Rainbow Dash, keep grinding. We don't have time for quality control if we want to win this thing. Ah! Get back, you! One bad apple spoils that bunch! Applejack, help me! There's no point in winning if we cheat. We'll just have to work harder. Come on, every pony. All right, then. Double time! <laughs> Jack. Thanks. <sighs> Integrity like that will always be rewarded. Flam and Flam win! What? what? We lost? Aw, oh, too bad, Apples. Guess you'll just have to find a new line of work that doesn't match your names quite so perfectly. Now, should we tear down all these tacky old buildings and put up new ones, brother? I don't see why not, brother. After all, this isn't Sweet Apple Acres anymore. How about Flim Flam Fields? I ought to press you into jerk sight! No, Rainbow Dash. A deal's a deal. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations to y'all. The cider business in Ponyville is yours. Come on, Apples. Let's go pack up our things. Fear not, every pony. There's more than enough cider to go around. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, every pony. Go on, y'all. It's okay. <laughs> Drink up, Pony Bell. Down the hat. rocks in it. I wouldn't pay one cent for this drip. You wouldn't pay even one cent? No! How about two cups for one cent? No! <laughs> two bits for the barrel? No! <laughs> it looks like we've encountered a slight problem here in Ponyville. No pony wants our product. Next town. Next town. Let's go, Flam. Let's go, Flam. Where go? That means Sweet Apple Acres 
is still in business. Plus, we can have high-quality Apple Family Cider. Because of this silly competition, we've made enough of our cider for the whole town. <laughs> Dear Princess Celestia, I wanted to share my thoughts with you. Ahem. I didn't learn anything. <laughs> I was right all along. If you take your time to do things the right way, your work will speak for itself. Sure, I could tell you I learned something about how my friends are always there to help me, and I can count on them no matter what. But truth is, I knew that already, too. I gotta think of something. Think, 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 Twilight, think! Ooh, that's it! Ooh, you're going to like Smarty Pants, and you're going to like her more than anything! One it needed spell. Works every time. Okay, okay, let's break it up. I think you can all see that there's an important lesson to be learned here about. Me. Come on, girls. We're all friends here, right? Don't you think you ought to share? No way! Big Macintosh! Thank goodness! You gotta help me get that doll away from those girls! So much. Now, if you could just give her to me. Nope. Oh, no! Give her back! No! Don't touch it! What's all the commotion about? They're fighting over that doll! That incredible, amazing doll! Y'all hear that? What in the name of all things oats and apples is going on here? Don't look at it! Don't look at what? My Smarty Pants doll. I enchanted her and now every pony is fighting over her. Why would you enchant your doll? Oh, I had to do something. I had nothing to report to Princess Celestia. I thought if I couldn't find a problem, I'd make a problem. The day is almost over. Not almost. Twilight Sparkle. Well, Nelly. the library. Goodbye, girls. If you care to visit, I'll be in Magic Kindergarten, back in Canterlot. Magic Kindergarten? Canterlot? We're never gonna see Twilight again! Uh, what are we gonna do, y'all? Of all the worst things that could happen, this is the worst possible thing! supposed to send you a letter about friendship every week. I miss the deadline. I'm a bad student. I'm tardy. You are a wonderful student, Twilight. I don't have to get a letter every week to know that. Really? Wait! You can't punish her! It wasn't her fault. I'm listening. Please, Your Highness. We all saw that Twilight was upset. But we thought that the thing that she was worrying about wasn't worth worrying about. 
come on, Miss Cheerily. Ask him to be your very special soul pony. <gasps> oh my gosh, look! Big Mac? Yup. You have something stuck in your teeth. Oh, come on! Well, this has been strange. Yup. I need to get going, but it's always great running into a good friend. Yup. Do you think it just wasn't romantic enough? Maybe it was too romantic. Either way, we failed. Oh, there's gotta be something else we can... Oh! Oh my goodness, I didn't even see you there. I'm so, so sorry. Oh, uh, it's okay, Twilight. It was an accident. I've just been reading the most fascinating book about hearts and hooves day. Did you know that this holiday got its start because of a love potion? Did you say a love potion? That's right. It even has the recipe. I don't suppose we could borrow that book for a little while, do ya? Of course you can. I have another book here that I think you'll... <laughs> Take a tuft of cloud. A bright rainbow's glow. Stir with a Pegasus feather. Hey! Fast, not slow. Serve to do ponies who aren't in the know. I feel kind of bad tricking my brother and Miss Cheerly this way. What's the problem? We all agree these two are perfect for one another. Yeah, they just need a little nudge. And what could make them happier than being together, right? Rad. Oh, oh, here they come. Hi, Miss Cheerily. Hello again, girls. Hello, Big Mac. Would you three like to tell us why it was so very important that we meet you here? Punch! Excuse me? Punch! We made punch. We were gonna set up a stand and try to sell it, but <laughs> we needed some pony to taste test it first. Yep. We thought you two would be perfect together. To test it. Together. So, uh, we'll just leave you two alone. <laughs> together to test it. <laughs> I'm very sorry about this. I mentioned to the girls that I don't have a very special sun pony, and I believe they're putting us in these awkward situations because they've decided it should be you. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose we should just humor them for a moment. This punch does look delicious. Yep. I think they're gonna drink it. To good friends. They're drinking it. They're drinking it. <laughs> they're looking into each other's eyes. <laughs> they're, they're about, about to, to be in, in for a big surprise. Big Mac? Yup. Will you be my very special sun pony? Yup. Yes! He's her special sun pony. She's his special sun pony. He's my special sun pony. <laughs> yup. Aww. He's my schmoopy doopy sweetie weedy pony pie. You're my schmoopy doopy sweetie weedy pony pie. Did he just say? You're my cutie patootie lovey dovey honey bunny. You're my hearty smarty spooky woochy baby weedy. Sugar Cute Corner will cheer you up. No, it won't. A party 
cheer you up. No, it won't. A lovely new chapeau will cheer you up. No, it won't. Come on, Apple Bloom. It's just a cutie mark. Or lack of a cutie mark. Shh, that's not helping. Apple Bloom, where are you going? Apple Bloom, come back! Well, who is it that we have here? Why, it's Apple Bloom, my dear. Oh! What has happened to you, youth? Ah, you've gone and chipped your tooth. Come with me. I have just the trick that will fix you up quite quick. I tried everything, Decora, and still no cutie mark. Your frustration is well understood, but one must be patient for all things good. Ugh, I've heard that from every pony I know, and now from every zebra I know. I'm just too impatient to be patient. I just want my cutie mark and I want it now! For your cutie mark, you will have to wait. We must fix that tooth before it's too late. Now, drink down every little drop, and this mixture will mend that chip on top. Oh, my star apples, you did, Sakura! Golly! You have tonics that heal all sorts of ailments. Bad bones, bad back, bad breath. Yes, little one, it is true. I have many a healing brew. And not only stuff that fixes the bad, but stuff that brings the good. Good health, good hair, good heavens. Hmm. I bet you can mix up a brew to fix anything. There are many mixtures in this room. But none for what you want, dear Apple Bloom. A magic potion does not hold the key. For a cutie mark, time is the only remedy. Fine. What you got going on there? I am brewing up another mix for a rooster and his chicks. Seems the rooster has lost its crow, making mornings very slow. Hey, I've seen that flower blooming in Ponyville. What is it? It is one we call Heart's Desire. A dash will ignite the rooster's fire. With Heart's Desire, his talent comes into view, and he'll give a mighty cock a doo doo doo. Sowie! Heart's Desire, huh? I mean, but what is this? I've run out of amethyst. I must go get this purple flower for my brew to have full power. Yeah, you go, you go. I'm <laughs> so hungry. Yeah, I can't wait. Ah! Ah! Apple Bloom, you got your cutie mark. Shy, what are you doing? That's no way to behave. Didn't you see what he did to new Fluttershy? And he thought new Fluttershy was a pushover. No, sweetie, he didn't. We saw the whole thing. We think that you've taken your assertiveness training a little too far. What? You just want new Fluttershy to be a doormat like old Fluttershy. But old Fluttershy is gone! New Fluttershy? Old Fluttershy? What happened to nice Fluttershy? We want that Fluttershy back. No, you want wimp Fluttershy. You want pushover Fluttershy. You want do anything to her and she won't complain Fluttershy. Yeah, too many Fluttershy's to keep track of. Make it stop. Things getting too complicated for your simple little brain, Pinkie Pie. 
Now, stop right there. Let's not let things descend into petty insults. Why not? I thought petty was what you're all about, Rarity, with your petty concerns about fashion. <gasps> hey, leave her alone. Fashion is her passion. Oh, and what are you passionate about? Birthday cake? Party hats? I can't believe that the two most frivolous ponies in Ponyville are trying to tell New Fluttershy how to live her life when they are throwing their own lives away on pointless pursuits that no pony else gives a flying feather about! <laughs> Looks like Nasty Fluttershy is here to stay! Oh, I cannot believe what that monster Iron Will has done to you! <laughs> <laughs> Iron Will's not a monster! He's a Minotaur! I'm the monster. <clears throat> Fluttershy, are you in there? It's Pinkie Pie and Rarity! Go away! Go away before Nasty Fluttershy strikes again! Oh, sweetie, we all said things that we regret. We did? Shh! Pinkie's right. I'm the only one to blame. But don't worry, I'm never coming out of my house again. Every pony will be a lot safer with me and my mean mouth locked away. Sweetie, Pinkie Pie doesn't blame you, nor do I. You just received some bad advice from that Iron Will character. Yeah, he's the one that made you act super duper nasty. <laughs> what I mean is, there are other ways to assert yourself besides yelling at every pony. Yes, you can stand up for yourself without being unpleasant about it. Uh, I'm not sure I can. I'm too far gone. Whenever I try to assert myself, I become a monster. Oh, sweetie, you're not a monster. No, but he is. Iron Will's my name. Training ponies is my game. What a darling little catchphrase. Your friend Fluttershy loved Iron Will's catchphrases. Word on the street is that she doesn't take no guff from no pony. So, Iron Will is here to collect Iron Will's fee. Fluttershy is in no shape to deal with that creep. Uh, I'm sure a big, brave, powerful, and rich monster, I mean, Minotaur, like you, doesn't need that money right away. You can afford to come back later. Are you kidding? Fluttershy is overdue as it is. Iron Will collects now. Do something. We're not even sure Fluttershy is home right now. Uh, she might be off frolicking with some woodland creatures. Uh, why don't you give us some time to track her down for you? Well, Iron Will does have some grocery shopping to do. Iron Will will come back this afternoon. But that's only half a day. We need one full day at least. Iron Will will delay for half a day and no longer. A full day. Half day. Full day. Half day. Half day. Full day. We need half a day and no more. Well, you'll get a full day and no less. Okie dokie. See you tomorrow. Wait, what? Huh, sounds like the search won't be necessary. Iron Will collects now. But we have an agreement. You gotta come back tomorrow. When some pony tries to block, show them that you rock. Yeah! 